This is a video write-up for the channel on Steget Up for 100 points in the Steganography category from HackCon CTF 2018. The challenge prompt here is it isn't as easy as it looks, and we're given this file to download, which we can go ahead and wget right over here. Cool. So now that we've got it downloaded, we can open it up in our terminal with I of GNOME, EOG, and it looks like what would be dark code, don't have in blah, 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 uh, the, the flag kind of pieces of it redacted, so whatever. We can just kind of deal with that. We know that we're working with a steganography challenge because this is that category and that's the name of the, the challenge. So I wanted to reach for the classic low-hanging fruit, just run it through StegSolve. I've used StegSolve before in a ton of videos and challenges and problems, etc. So if you haven't seen it before, you can Google it, download it. It is a Java archive file. Go ahead and download and blah, blah, blah. So I'm going to go ahead and just locate where it is on my hard drive because I know I've used it before. There are probably just tons of copies of it lying around. So once we've got it, we can go ahead and Java jar that program and then hit O to open up a file. If you've got it in the current directory of the challenge, you'll just get everything in there. So now I can see the start of the file here. It's kind of too big for my screen. Whatever, I'll deal with it. So... Uh, you can arrow through different kinds of uh, versions that you're seeing of the image. In this case, it's checking out all the alpha planes, and at the uh, least significant bit for the alpha plane, we see a bunch of QR codes. So, cool. Let's go ahead and scrape these out, because this must be doing something interesting. So I hit Shift and uh, per, like Print Screen. So I in Linux, I can just get a cursor to go ahead and drag stuff that I'd like to see, and I can save this as... Um, put it in the current directory and like one dot png great and i know that now i've got to keep track of that other qr code that i wasn't able to fit on the screen so i kind of moved my finger <laughs> along my monitor as i scrolled that way so i'd be able to keep track of it and now we can go ahead and steal those as well save this as I guess 2.png or whatever we want, and then we should have those files that we can want to work with. So if you don't have ZBar image installed, you can sudo apt install, I think it's ZBar tools, or even just try and run ZBar image and see if it'll get anything for you. And then that is a command line utility that will allow you to like uh, try and decode QR codes just as an image from the command line. So what we can do is I can run ZBar image, on 1.png, and it's able to look through all of those QR codes. We can see the start of the flag format just down below, so we've got to go ahead and reverse this. First, let's cut it up. Let's get uh, the second field so we ignore the colon in that part of the QR code right there. Let's go ahead and reverse this with tack, so all the lines are flipped. Now we have dark code, so many of these things, blah, blah, blah. And let's remove all of the new line characters, so now we've got the first part of the flag. So we can go ahead and say this is flag.text. Let's do the same thing with number two and then append that to flag.text. So now we just should have, all right, dark, so many of them, lol, I have to make this flag song for so reason, LMAO code. So that is the final flag that we need and that is how we solve this. If you wanted to, you could make a get flag script that would just have to uh, have the 1.png and a 2.png, it's just the images the QR code scraped out of that image to begin with, and you can have it just do that exact same thing that we just did in the command line. Just cut them up, evaluate them, reverse them, blah, blah, blah. But that is it. That is how we solve that challenge. Steg it up. Go ahead and mark that as complete. And if you wanted to, you could submit it for 100 points, but unfortunately the game is over. If you did want to join us, another uh, cool people um, playing the Capture the Flag games, uh, I know Nighthawk is coming up this weekend and ICTF following that. Please do join our Discord server. Link in the description. Cool, cool people to play the games with and team up. Quick special shout out to the people that support me on Patreon. Thank you guys so much. $1 or more a month on Patreon will give you a special shout out just like this at the end of every video so you know you are supporting the channel. $5 or more on Patreon will give you early access to everything that I release on YouTube before it goes live because I normally record in bulk and then gradually upload on like a scheduled release. If you did like this video, please do like, comment, and subscribe. Link in the description to join our Discord server. It is an awesome community of CTF players, programmers, and hackers. Come hang out with me and a bunch of other cool people. I would love to see you guys on Patreon, but I can't wait to see you in the next video. Thanks. See ya.